of the BRICS countries, Brazil, Russia, India, China, including South Africa, have substantial bilateral relations with the African continent. That is the basis on which BRICS as a collective relate to the African countries as a whole. And we believe that BRICS have substantial opportunities for the African continent, especially addressing its development uh, needs, as well as helping Africa address its economic diversification, its industrialization, industrialization drive, its diversification of its uh, economy, and also the infrastructure challenge, the human resource development challenge that Africa faces. So it's a relationship where BRICS can work together with the African countries in addressing these various developmental challenges that the African continent face. That is why last year when South Africa hosted the BRICS summit, we chose to have a retreat with the African leaders to see how the BRICS leaders could work with the African countries in addressing its various challenges and in scaling up economic interaction between uh, BRICS countries and between the African countries. We also had the AU Commission chairperson and the chair of the African Union present during this interaction and there was agreement that South Africa will continue to serve as the link between the BRICS countries and the African continent in taking forward the major decisions that emanated out of the uh, summit in South Africa with the African leadership. We believe that uh, this is a win-win situation for the BRICS countries, all of whom, as I've indicated, are already in Africa, but we need to have a coordinated approach in terms of how they relate to Africa to ensure that as much as they need uh, raw materials and commodities from the African continent, they help us as Africa to address value addition, to address the issues of industrialization, to address the issues of, of infrastructure development, to help build a stronger Africa. So these are some of the positives emanating from uh, the relationship between BRICS countries and the African continent.